Hi, my name is Sean with Agco. Today I'm going to show you the top wear parts, consumables, and accessories you'll encounter while owning or operating the Massey Ferguson 2800 M-Series tractor. All the parts mentioned in this video are available for order on parts.agcocorp.com or by visiting your local Agco dealer. With that, let's get started. On the left of our 2800 M-Series tractor, we're gonna start out front with our battery. As we move back towards the rear of the tractor, we are gonna have some relays and fuses located up on the left-hand side of the engine. Directly behind them, underneath this panel, we have our engine alternator. Down below, if you ever need to check your engine oil level, this is the location of your dipstick. And if we go straight back from the dipstick, that is where your starter is gonna be located for the engine. As we continue towards the rear of the tractor on the left side of our 2800M series, we have our fuel cap, and there is also a strainer located right underneath that fuel cap. On the outside of the cab, in the front and the rear, we do have windshield wipers and your windshield wiper motors. In the top left-hand corner of our cab, you have the uh, HVAC fresh air filter. And then as we get on the inside of the cab, on the left-hand side of your steering column, you're gonna have your fuse box. And there are some relays um, located underneath the center panel. From there, on the right-hand side of your center console, you're gonna have your key switch and your key. And then, like with all of our other tractors, we do have your operator presence switch. This one is located in the cushion of the seat. Also with our cab options, we do have the uh, recirculation air filter in the cab roof. And then as for some accessories for the tractor, we do have a radio option and ram mounts you can get for it. At the rear of our 2800 M series tractor, on either side located in their housing is it, are gonna bring you your brake friction disc. Also on the left hand side, you are going to have your um, site level gauge for your hydraulic level inside your transmission. When you do get to servicing your transmission, on the bottom side, you do have your suction strainer and cartridge filter. They are on the left-hand side of the transmission. When you go to fill your flu fluid level in your transmission, at the very top, this is going to be your hydraulic fill port location. As always, do remember to always use Agco Genuine Fluids. As we continue back from there, we do have the breather for the transmission housing. Whenever you're doing a service, it's a good idea to take a look at that and make sure there's no buildup in there. This is gonna help prevent future leaks from wheel seals and stuff like that. As we go up, your windshield washer reservoir fluid is located at the back of the cab and also your slow moving vehicle sign. On the right hand side of our tractor, if you ever do find yourself needing them, the lug bolts are available. Also to my left, Underneath this panel, you are gonna have your fuel filter. And as we move forward from there, your quick couplers for your loader coupling. On the right-hand side of our engine for our 2800 M series tractor, towards the back of the engine block, you're gonna have your engine oil filter. As we move forward from there, our yellow cap is going to be our oil fill location. Now, when filling our engine oil, always be sure to use Agco Genuine Fluids. On the front of the AC compressor, running all of your other belt-driven components is going to be your engine belt. And then as we move forward from there, at the front of the radiator, you're going to have your engine air filter, and you are going to have your coolant overflow reservoir. This is where you're going to come to check and or add fluid to your coolant system. Moving down to the front axle on our 2800M series tractor, on the right-hand side of your axle is going to be your fill location. As always, when filling the tractor with any kind of fluid, remember to always use Agco Genuine Fluids. The drain for those ac that axle is going to be on the end of each drop axle at the very bottom for your two drain port locations. Moving on to the loader for our 2800M series tractor, you are gonna have grease ports at all of our pivot points. When greasing the tractor, make sure you do use Agco Genuine Lubricants. So those are the top wear parts, consumables, and accessories on the Massey Ferguson 2800 M-Series tractor. You can keep your machine running at its highest potential with an Agco Genuine Care Maintenance Service Plan. 
coverage includes your essential maintenance parts, plus value-added services like machine inspections and fluid sampling, all under prepaid plans to help cover you against rising maintenance costs. To order parts or to learn more about parts for this machine, head over to parts.agcocorp.com or visit your local Agco dealer. Thanks for watching.